they think you're full of yourself, but it's crazy because you never cared about anything like that. to the Mindset Elevator, everybody. I hope you guys are feeling great. Thank you so much for the ongoing support. This is going to be a shorter video, so let's get right into it. A lot of people are going to call you conceited. A lot of people feel like you're feeling yourself a little bit too much. You're bigging yourself up a little bit too much. You think you're the best. You think that you're better than everybody else. You're trying. You're actively making it a campaign to be better than everybody else. And all of these false claims, these falsified uh, comments and statements made by jealous people is only uh, going to to probably fuel your curiosity. Like, why are people really looking at you in this way? Why do people see you in this fashion? You are not trying to show up anybody. You don't care about competition. And of course, it shows who really does. These people see that you are a giant. You are a great. And the thing about it is that when people see that you are a very different, unique person, and you're doing a lot of crazy things on the planet, crazy good things is what I mean, then a lot of people are going to be very intimidated by this. And therefore, because the greatness is so profound, Found your initiatives are so profound, people are really going to start actively thinking that you're trying to prove something to them, you're trying to show something off, you're trying to be arrogant, you're trying to be pompous, even right. People are going to really make it seem like you know they got to kick you off your high horse, take you down a few notches because you're not supposed to be wiling like this, you're not supposed to be acting like this, you're not supposed to be this happy, this jovial about what you're doing. Oh, what you're doing is ordinary. Watch the dumbing down come in. What you're doing is ordinary. Everybody can do that, anyone can do that. I know someone who does that and they get more than you. And all these uh, dumbing down tactics right? Because they feel like if they make you feel like you have an inflated ego, if they make you feel like, you know, you're doing too much, if they make you feel like, you know what, you're not really popping right now, you're not really that hot right now, then maybe you'll stop. You know, that's the ultimate uh, quest here, the, the objective. Maybe you'll just stop. You know, you'll stop chasing what they know you're chasing. You'll stop growing. You'll stop getting things. You'll stop getting abundance because they know that's what you're getting now. And they feel like you're upgraded. A lot of people are looking at you now when they see that you have an upgraded lifestyle. Maybe because you, maybe it's simply you're down to your mindset. You have an upgraded mindset. You know, you have a positive way of seeing life now than what you used to see life like before. And so even that alone can be a trigger for people out here thinking, oh, so you think you're all that. You're really walking around moving like you think you know everything now and you think that you're hot now. You know, I remember when you were down here. Sure, they may remember when you were down here, but you're not down anymore. You know, but these people are not going to big you up for it. They're not going to congratulate you for it. They're not going to say, good job. I seen what you've been through. Nope. Unless they want a piece of the pie, they'll tell you what you want to hear. Other than that, most of these people out here, when you when they see you going up, they're going to move with you in a fake, fake way, and they're going to call you fake. They're going to call you fraudulent, and they're going to make it seem like, you know what? You just think you're better than everybody else. You're floating around thinking that nobody can touch you. Nobody can stop you, but that's what it is. Nobody can touch you, and nobody can stop you. You understand? Because you are under the reign of God. You are not under the reign of man. Man can't stop you from doing what you want to do, or not even that, but even doing what you were meant to do on this planet they didn't you know they may have triggered the call like they they may have put things in motion here where it's like you could see how man would disappoint people in your life situations jobs relationships etc these people and situations may have you know put you in this path of going to answer the call, you know, like really like going into your shell, going into a deep thought, deep thinking and thinking about what are you going to do next? Where are you going to go next? Finally, when you answer the call, you've been rejuvenated. Your, your eyes have been wide opened, right? And so now people see this new, fresh you that has a new mindset, new upgrades, right? You're living life to the fullest now. And people feel like it's not fair. People feel like it's fake. People feel like you think you're all that now. It can't be real. It can't be all that. She had to have help. He had to have help. It's like people don't want to give you your props. They want to dumb you down and minimize your efforts, minimize what you've been doing. It makes them feel better about it. It makes them feel good. It makes them feel, you know, rest assured that whatever it is that you're doing, it can be taken away from you. You know, it's only temporary. It's only in a, a placeholder. It can be taken out any time. And no. No, you're not going anywhere. No, you're not. You're not about to be stopped. <laughs> you know, you're 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 a train barreling down the tracks. You're not going to be stopped. 
you know, not stopped in time for a lot of these people. They're not going to be able to stop you. They're not going to be able to trouble you. A lot of folks are going to try to swindle you because they know they cannot stop you. They're going to go on the other bad side, you know, try to take something from you because they know that there is no stopping you. All in all, a lot of these folks just think that your head is big, you know, they think your head is big. They think that you're moving wild. They think that you're, you know, you're kind of bougie, you know, you're acting like you're the ish, but you are, you know, because you were chosen to be. That's, it's not that you're going out here with an arrogant, you know, arrogant attitude, an arrogant sense to yourself, an arrogant aura. No, you don't move like that. You know, it's because you're so great that it seems like that. You're so awesome. You've been, you've been transformed so deeply that it seems like, you know, you're walking like, <laughs> like you're walking on air, but it's because sky's the limit for you. You know, there's no ceiling to your success. No one's going to stop that. All right, everybody. So no, you're not arrogant. These people are going to try to make it seem like you are arrogant. They're going to make it seem like you think you know it all. You think you're the best, but it's because they see the very best qualities in you that they wish they saw in themselves. And they can't really say that. So all they, all they can really do to make themselves feel a little bit better is to say, you know what, you're, you're putting on a show, you're doing too much, you're being arrogant. You're trying to, you know, make people feel bad. No, Keep living your best life, everybody. Keep living your best life. Keep being confident, all right, in the right proportions. Always continue to be humble, all right? Continue to be gracious. Continue to work on yourselves. Thank you so much, everybody, for stopping by on the Mindset Elevator. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much once again for the ongoing support of this channel. I love you guys very much, reoccurring subscribers, new subscribers, and people who stop in once in a while. All of you guys are very appreciated on the Mindset Elevator. Keep going up and keep, you know, patting yourself on the back. You're doing well. Congratulations to you for all of your accomplishments that you have right now and that are pending, okay? Thank you so much and have a wonderful day. Bye.